Florida has the highest concentration of large freshwater springs in the world. Fed by the Florida aquifer, these natural bowls of liquid light are literally openings or windows, revealing the labyrinth of underground rivers that flow through Florida's limestone bedrock. But Florida springs are not eternal. They are being degraded in a variety of ways due to the state's increasing human population. The magnificent artesian springs in Florida are displaying alarming changes, including reductions in water flow, elevated nutrient concentrations, reductions in natural aquatic vegetation and fish, and increasing populations of filamentous algae. Mother Nature is providing a wake-up call to human society that it is time to clean up our act. There are several stressors that are affecting our springs. Reduced groundwater levels and increasing nitrate nitrogen concentrations are both indirect effects of human land use decisions. Altered plant and wildlife communities often result from excessive human recreation and aquatic plant management activities. These stresses are obvious even to the most casual observer of springs. The Florida Springs Institute is working toward the vision of having a permanent research center focused on springs and aquatic ecology and education at a major Florida spring. In the meantime, they are devoting their time and energy to developing restoration and management goals for as many springs as possible and advocating for their protection and restoration. The principal short-term goal is to raise public and agency awareness about the need to cut back on groundwater extraction and nitrogen loading to groundwater. The mission of the Florida Springs Institute is to provide a focal point for improving the understanding of springs ecology and to foster the development of science-based education and management actions needed to restore and protect the springs throughout Florida. This mission is fulfilled by developing a quantitative and scientifically defensible baseline of ecological data that documents their existing environmental conditions and trends over time. Disseminating current best available knowledge and information about the ecology and environmental condition of Florida Springs to the public and their leaders by recommending management actions needed to reverse adverse changes occurring in many springs in the state. Promoting a strong economy throughout the spring's heartland of North and Central Florida that is compatible with healthy springs and that directly and indirectly supports wise land use practices to reduce pollution affecting springs and to maintain historic spring flows that support healthy spring, plant, and animal communities. Increasing the public's awareness of the threats to springs and the need to fund basic spring science commensurate with the documented importance of healthy springs to maintaining Florida's economic health. Clear, pure groundwater is the lifeblood of Florida's artesian springs. Remove flowing water and a spring is a sinkhole, a stagnant window into the dark dead limestone below our feet. The spring's functionality, or life, declines essentially to zero when its flow ceases and increases proportional to flow. The living assemblage of plants and animals characteristic of Florida springs are directly dependent upon the quantity of groundwater that springs forth from its limestone vent. All life is dependent upon water, including human life. Springs and humans in North and Central Florida are dependent upon the same water supply. There is really only one highly interconnected Florida aquifer, a single supply of groundwater for humans and springs. Join us in support of the Florida Springs Institute and the important work they are doing to raise awareness about the issues facing Florida's turquoise jewels. To learn more, visit floridaspringsinstitute.org.